Uh, well, why do you feel it was important for you to come out? This is a very compelling story, and it touches on, um, it's, it's a tragedy on many levels, and it touches on so many important issues. I prosecuted cases in Manhattan for a number of years, and I had teen girls. In some of my cases, they're tried as adults when it comes to very serious crimes like this one, talking about a triple murder. And uh, it's, it's so it's important for people to understand, A, young people are teenagers. They're tried as adults. They don't necessarily go through juvenile court, especially for crimes like this. B, the, the victim in, in this. There are victims, the three men who were murdered, but also this, this young mother who was out there on the street and didn't have family. She didn't think she had any other opportunities. And so she was a victim. She was taken advantage of. And, and so it's important for people to understand that there are young women out there like her. And sex trafficking is a huge issue in this country now. And, you know, so they're on so many different levels, it's important for this story to be told. And, you know, she's still in prison. She's serving life without parole down in Atlanta. And she has a son now that's growing up without his parents. So um, it's just, you know, it's a, it's a tragic story, but also a teaching experience so people can be aware of some of the issues that are happening in our country. So what would you tell young girls that might be in a similar situation as Felicia Blakely? There are more programs out there now than ever before that help homeless women and especially women who are mothers and don't have a place to go and a lot of people turn you know, when, when someone comes in and they tell you a story it, it, if it sounds too good to be true it probably is and but when you're so young you're so vulnerable and, and, and impressionable you don't think that that you oftentimes buy into what they're selling and it's important to know that there are other there are other ways out there it may not be the easy way but look at what the easy way in, in this case started as what you thought was easy money turned into such a tragedy and what do you have coming up in the future I am a, I host a court show right now it's on the air every day so check your local listings judge faith and uh, it's a daytime show so if you work set your DVR <laughs> Studio Q show. Now you know.